And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And it's first time around for these two countries in the group stage here at the 2023 World Cup. It's Australia and they take on Nigeria. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And the starting 11 for Australia. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And here's the starting 11 for Nigeria. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And the contest begins. Well, she has no intention of passing with the ball. Gorey. Haley Rasso. Going well. Will it be? Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Now, how about the short corner? Not increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Let's see about the delivery. Not all that convincing defensively. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be Michelle Alozi Ayinde in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here and that wasn't a million miles away almost the equaliser well it's not a bad effort is it but they've got to find a way back into this one Poor attempt at a pass, really. It's 
Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, good looking play with the ball of defeat. Chance to play it in. Real chance. They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Corey on to Kerr must take the lead here and that is defending of the highest order can they hit on the break can they take advantage of the situation well, the players back in position now well, possibilities inside the box really a very poor ball Hayley Rasso. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Ifeoma Onumonu. Dangerous looking attack. Could be. And a goal. Just what she was hoping to contribute. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Grant. On to Gori. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Halimatu Ayinde. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Textbook defending inside the box. Sam Kerr. And you can sense the threat is there. And just like that, they don't have the ball anymore. Ifeoma Onumonu. I must say, this looks promising. Real chance. And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. So there it is, 3-1, the current scoreline here. Katrina Gori. Courtney Vine. On to Ford. Well, the fans want her to take on the shot. Body in the way. Could cross it in here. And a bad pass it was. Gives it a go. 
And no problems for her. Untidy on the ball. Plenty of options. Could put one back here. And thumped away. Tony Payne. Teammates available. Vital interception. The danger was very real. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Vine. Options in the centre. Chance to make a game of it here. And a goal! Not over just yet. Well, here's the goal again. And what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. But I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. are getting their money's worth 3-2 in this match so two minutes of stoppage time here a good and fair challenge and the flag raised offside it is The first half here comes to an end. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. And support available. Well, the supporters think it's on. Well, really, making the goalkeeper's life simple. That should be hit in the back of the net. That was a big, big chance. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Possession changing hands. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. And time for the change now. Ellie Carpenter. Grant. Now with Catley. Caitlin Ford. Vine. This could be the equaliser. And that is defending of the highest order. Counter attacking, very much an option. Caitlin Ford and an astute piece of defending Onumonu oh. 
Rasso. Now with Ford. Just the challenge that was required. 30 minutes to go then. Now what can they do from here? Onumono! And it's gone in. Just what the doctor ordered. Things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Well, look at this again, because this is a really well-worked goal. The passing is incisive, the movement off the ball is bright, and it leads to a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a great goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Decent position. Could be a chance to break here. Tony Payne. Is this the moment? A fine use of the ball. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Ford. Emily van Egmond. She has teammates around her. And getting the better of her marker. Tremendous block. And now the delivery. Well, they survived the attack. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. And a substitution in the offing. Emily van Egmond. On to Kerr. Could pull one back here. Oh, it's goalkeeping at its finest. Absolutely right. That is a wonderful save. Top class stuff from the keeper. And the short option preferred. And there she is at the double. Nobody can get close to her. Well, here it is again. And really, you have to question the goalkeeper. She shouldn't be beaten inside that near post, even if it was a good strike. this 4-3 Ayinde perfectly positioned to take it away ten minutes left for play and a tidy challenge Ayinde. Kerr. Breaking at pace. 
Well, great read there to intercept. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Well, she's gliding through. Oh, she's broken things up magnificently. Real chance. A goal! Sheer excitement. Level again here. Well, here's the replay. And sometimes when you've been pressed high up the field, you have to go that little bit longer and not play out through the thirds. And that's what they tried to do here. They had their pocket picked and suddenly they find the ball in the back of the net. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Level pegging, but can they change that? Chance to cross. Oh, that is a superb save. Oshola. Tony Payne. Well, the electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. And I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. How oh, can they find a late leveller? Now, who can she pass it to? Now, veering in field. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. And that will be that, the final whistle... And it is a tale of misery for them. Not the result they were hoping for. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out.